Hello citizens, I am back after a bit of a creative break due to real life and today I am coming to you with a highly requested video. Today I am going to talk about some of the most common bugs I encounter in Star Citizen and how to work around them. Now to most of you this won't be anything new because most of us just go straight to the workaround when playing. However I think this video may be useful to some of the new backers out there. As always, if you like this video, sacrifice a like to the YouTube algorithm and subscribe for more. And here's a shout out to our amazing patrons for their support of the channel and the armory. Speaking of the armory, I am done with the major refactor and I am moving on to new features that will be announced soon, so stay tuned. Now, during the recording of this video, I found out that the most reliable way to avoid bugs in Star Citizen is to try and get them on video, so I won't be able to show you all of these, but let's get right to it. I'm going to start with the one that annoys me the most. You open your star map, you find your destination, but the route won't set. This issue is very annoying, but in most cases can be worked around by trying to quantum to a different OM or moon. After that, you should be able to set a route to your intended destination. I have also heard that this bug will be fixed in 317, but that remains to be seen. Staying with quantum travel, sometimes when you try to quantum, it doesn't work. The workaround is very simple. Just turn your ship away from the destination until it unlocks, then realign and then try again. If this doesn't work, try to quantum to a different location and try again. Moving on to ATC not responding to your call. This bug seems to be related to server performance and how busy the landing zone is. One workaround I have found is to cancel the call for landing and try again. Usually this works, but if it doesn't, try to quantum away and try to come back and try again. Moving on to a very easy to fix but very annoying bug. Sometimes when you power on a turret equipped with energy weapons, your ammo count won't charge. The workaround is very simple. Power the turret off and on and that should fix it. If it doesn't, getting out of the turret and back in can help or you can try to power cycle the whole ship. Moving on to missions. Sometimes missions don't update their state. This seems to mostly happen with bunker missions and bounties and others where an NPC needs to spawn to continue the mission. It seems to depend on performance and server health. I have found that either waiting or leaving the area and coming back seems to get the mission going. If that doesn't help, the only solution is unfortunately to switch servers. And I'm going to close this video off with two issues with ship restocking. First, restocking service is not being available after you land. This seems to be a server performance related issue or it can also be caused by an improper landing. The most reliable workaround I have found is to store and respawn your ship and then try to rearm and refuel again. The second restocking issue is much more annoying. Sometimes spent missiles will not restock. I don't know exactly what causes this, but there are a few things you can try to fix this. First, you can try to respawn your ship and then try to restock again, but this doesn't always work. Second, you can claim your ship, which seems to work in most cases. And I've also been told that sometimes you might need to manually re-equip the missiles onto your ship, but I haven't been able to reproduce this. If none of this works, unfortunately your only remaining option is a character reset. And with that being said, that's it for tonight. If you have any other bugs and workarounds, post them in the comments. Thank you for watching, fly safe and I will see you in the verse.